9 Common Signs of Ovarian Cancer Ovarian cancer is a condition characterized by the growth of cancerous cells in the ovaries, two almond-shaped organs situated on either side of the uterus. These organs play a vital role in producing female hormones and eggs. Detecting ovarian cancer in its early stages can be challenging, and it tends to spread rapidly. The ovaries house multiple small glands responsible for releasing an egg each month during a woman's menstrual cycle. Additionally, they produce essential female hormones, such as estrogen and progesterone, which regulate a woman's menstrual cycle, fertility, and pregnancy. Ovarian cancers often initiate as abnormal cell growths on the surface lining of the ovary, which may turn cancerous if they continue to proliferate unchecked or invade other tissues and organs. Let's explore 9 Common Signs of Ovarian Cancer. Approximately 6% of women will experience ovarian cancer at some point in their lives, equating to about 1 in 78 women. This condition is more prevalent in older women and those who have never been pregnant or had children. As per the American Cancer Society, around 22,000 new ovarian cancer cases were diagnosed in 2021, resulting in nearly 14,000 deaths. Ovarian cancer constitutes approximately 2% of all cancers among women in the United States. The encouraging news is that many women can be cured of ovarian cancer, but prompt treatment is essential. Unfortunately, ovarian cancer often lacks early symptoms, leading to late-stage diagnoses, drastically impacting treatment outcomes. On average, the five-year survival rate for ovarian cancer is approximately 35%, contingent on various factors like the disease's stage at diagnosis, the person's general health, and the chosen treatment method, surgery or chemotherapy. While ovarian cancer is most commonly observed in women over the age of 63, it can affect younger individuals as well. A significant factor contributing to its development is family history. Individuals with a close relative who had ovarian cancer have a higher than average risk, and if multiple family members have experienced it, the risk further increases. Thankfully, there are several early symptoms that can indicate the presence of ovarian cancer. Understanding these symptoms is essential, so let's delve into the different types of ovarian cancers. Epithelial ovarian cancer. This is the most prevalent form, accounting for approximately 90% of all ovarian cancers. It begins in the cells lining the surface of the ovary. Germ cell ovarian cancer. Less common than epithelial ovarian cancer, this type of cancer originates before birth or shortly after, making it possible to find in children and adolescents. Around 8% of all ovarian cancers are germ cell tumors, with most cases occurring in women in their 40s. Stromal ovarian cancer. This is the rarest type, comprising only 2% of all ovarian cancer diagnoses. It is more prevalent in late adolescence and early adulthood. As ovarian cancer is often identified at an advanced stage, it may not always be possible to recognize symptoms early on. However, some symptoms are common in cases of early ovarian cancer, including frequent bloating. Number 1. Frequent bloating. One of the primary indicators of ovarian cancer is frequent bloating. Many women experience a persistent feeling of bloating in the lower abdomen, which can be mistaken for menstrual cramps. In some cases, constipation or diarrhea may also be present. While it is natural to feel bloated after eating, if this sensation occurs more often than usual and is accompanied by pain or other unusual symptoms, it is crucial to consult your doctor promptly to rule out ovarian cancer. Number 2. Lower back pain. Lower back pain is frequently among the initial indications of ovarian cancer. This discomfort may intensify after periods or bowel movements and can be either persistent or intermittent. Pain in the pelvis or abdomen often radiates to the groin area and might feel like a continuous dull ache rather than sharp pain. Physical exertion, such as coughing, sneezing, or lifting heavy objects, may exacerbate the pain. Number 3. Constipation. Constipation is a prevalent symptom associated with ovarian cancer. It occurs when the stool in the colon becomes hard and dry, often due to insufficient water and fiber intake. The tumor itself might exert pressure on the colon or rectum, contributing to constipation. 
Additionally, the tumor can cause intestinal muscles to contract, making it challenging for stool to pass through. Stool changes related to ovarian cancer include having less frequent bowel movements than usual, feeling bloated or full after eating, experiencing straining during bowel movements, and having fewer normal bowel movements than before. If you have observed these symptoms, don't forget to like our video and subscribe to our channel before we proceed to the next symptom, so you never miss out on our new content. Number 4. Fatigue Ovarian cancer symptoms may encompass fatigue, which typically develops gradually and could be accompanied by other indicators such as loss of appetite, bloating, and indigestion. Unfortunately, the symptoms of ovarian cancer are often vague and lack specificity, making it challenging to arrive at a diagnosis. As a consequence, many women mistakenly attribute these symptoms to stress or the natural aging process, leading them to delay seeking treatment for ovarian cancer. Number 5. Pain or discomfort in the abdomen or pelvis. Pain or discomfort in the abdomen or pelvis is another prevalent symptom of ovarian cancer. Typically, the cancer does not cause noticeable pain in these areas until it reaches advanced stages. The intensity of the pain can vary significantly, and numerous individuals with ovarian cancer remain unaware of their condition until it is diagnosed at stage 3 or 4. This underscores the importance of regular screening tests, as they can identify the disease before any symptoms become apparent. Number 6. Quickly feeling full when eating. Many women experience a rapid sensation of fullness after eating, leading them to consume only about half of their usual meal. Some may even feel nauseous or suffer from diarrhea and vomiting if they eat excessively. Feeling bloated or quickly full without a reason are typical symptoms of an enlarged stomach, which can result from fluid accumulation due to pressure from an ovarian cyst or tumor on neighboring organs or abdominal structures. Hash 7. A frequent, urgent need to urinate. The most prevalent symptom of ovarian cancer is a frequent and urgent need to urinate. This condition may arise due to an enlarged pelvic tumor exerting pressure on the bladder or the ureter, which is the tube connecting the kidneys and the bladder. While most women do not encounter frequent urination before receiving an ovarian cancer diagnosis, it remains crucial for women to be vigilant about these symptoms, along with any alterations in bowel habits. Number 8. A change in the menstrual cycle. Symptoms of ovarian cancer can differ among women, and some may not exhibit any symptoms at all. Doctors often advise women to undergo ovarian cancer screening from the age of 35 onwards, but being aware of potential symptoms is essential. One symptom that many women tend to overlook is a change in the menstrual cycle. While irregular menstruation is common during menopause, it is crucial to consult a doctor if you experience such changes. Another symptom to be aware of is difficulty eating, which some women may encounter. If you notice these symptoms, seeking medical advice is recommended. Number 9. Difficulty eating. Individuals who lead busy or stressed lives may frequently experience nausea and upset stomach. While occasional difficulty eating might not raise immediate concerns, it can serve as a potential sign of ovarian cancer. Ovarian cancer is often insidious, remaining asymptomatic in its early stages until it spreads to other organs. To diagnose ovarian cancer, doctors use an abdominal ultrasound, perform pelvic exams, and may recommend a CT scan, MRI, PET scan, or biopsy if cancer is suspected. Treatment options for ovarian cancer depend on the stage and type of the cancer. Early stage cancers are often treated with surgery, whereas advanced stages may involve a combination of surgery, chemotherapy, and hormonal therapy. Surgery to remove an ovarian tumor can be conducted laparoscopically or robotically. Chemotherapy may be administered before or after surgery to shrink tumors and eliminate remaining cancer cells. Improving the chances of early detection is vital for better outcomes. The five-year survival rate for early-stage ovarian cancer is 92%, whereas for advanced-stage disease, it drops to approximately 17%. Raising awareness and seeking prompt medical attention for any concerning symptoms can significantly contribute to beating this disease. If you found this video useful and informative, please like and subscribe to our channel for more valuable content.
Thank you for watching.